Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to ASVAB Weekly. This is a place where we eliminate bad choices and focus on the right answers concerning the ASVAB test. Today's question comes from the test area of mechanical comprehension. Okay, so let's jump right into the question. The question is asking us, this image represents what configuration of pulley? We have four answers. A, block and tackle. B, movable. C, fixed. D, simple. Most of you may not be that familiar with mechanical comprehension, so I'm going to help you out on this one. This is a block and tackle system. The reason why I'm explaining this is because there's some other areas that I'd like to enlighten you on. The mechanical advantage of a block and tackle system equals the number of sections of rope that support the moving block. So we want to talk about mechanical advantage. Here we have two strings on what I would call the working side and this would be the effort side. So we would actually be pulling down on this rope and the forces would be exerted on this on these two ropes and the mechanical advantage would be two. Now what is mechanical advantage? Mechanical advantage is how much machine multiplies the effort force put into it. So this has a mechanical advantage of two not including the pull rope. This has a mechanic advantage of three, one, two, three, four, five, and this has six. So this is the easiest, or this will lift it the most weight with less with less effort, if you would. So uh, back to our question, the block and tackle system. Um, as far as movable, fixed, and simple, I think they were just throwing that at us. A spoil, what I would call a spoiler. Uh, this is a fixed pulley. This is a movable pulley, and this whole pulley configuration is what we would call a simple machine. So that concludes our video and I'd like to thank you for watching. If you or anybody you know is preparing for the ASVAB test, please like and subscribe. This is Keno Thomas with the ASVAB Weekly. Good night.